will be measuring a point in SiteWorks. When you open up SiteWorks and come into the work screen, measure mode is always the default mode you will be in. But if you are in stakeout mode or COGO, to go back to measure mode, you can come here to the main menu, go to measure, click on that and it brings you here back to measure mode. So before we take our shot, let's go over a couple of different items. Here, if you click on this, this gives you your measuring type. We have a couple of options here, standing, walking, vehicle, static, which is used for measuring control points, and then the easy level, which is for checking elevations. We will choose standing because we'll be standing and taking a single shot. From here, it's gonna ask you what your settings are gonna be. Are you using a quick release? The quick release is the quick release right here underneath the rover. If you're using that, hit yes. If not, you can select no. The next, we're gonna look at the antenna height. The antenna height is your rover pole and what the measurement it's set to. We're gonna go for two meters. If everyone is set at two meters, you can just punch in 2M and it will automatically calculate to 6.562 feet. After that, you hit accept. We are ready. The next thing we're gonna look at is our measure type. Our measure type is gonna be a point. So this gives you a couple of options for some information. A point name. So here we're gonna do topo one, which is our first topo shot, point code, which is optional. You can set a description or a code here for this shot. Point type, we have two options here. We have surface and feature. Surface is just like it's described, a surface, a topo shot. Or if you're selecting feature, you can use this item to take a shot of a specific feature on your job site, like a catch basin or manhole cover, and name it that specific thing and it'll display you know where that location is so for this we're going to take a topo shot we're going to select surface we're going to show every time so that we see it on our design hit accept so from here we're going to hit the plus sign topo one no code surface show every time yes hit accept take our first shot now say we're taking a topo of an entire area and we move to our next section right here we can just go to the plus sign hit that it automatically names it topo 2 which is the next number down ensure everything is correct and hit accept this will continue until you change the name of your shot so now let's shoot a feature so we'll move our rover over here to this catch basin. We're gonna hit our plus sign. And now we're gonna call name this one catch basin. Catch basin one. We're gonna change from surface to feature. We're gonna show every time. Notice here that you do not have your cut and fill display like you would by changing it to feature do not get that information the coloration of your cut, cut and feel that is how you measure a point using SiteWorks like this video give it a thumbs up for more content like this click subscribe for instant access to updates and new videos also check the description for links to additional support files and content and as always Thanks for watching.